Western Mass News is your local sports authority. The first full week of spring training games is underway for the Boston Red Sox. Manager Alex Cora back with the team after being fired last season for his involvement in a sign stealing scandal and then rehired. The Sox looking at a fresh start this season. Western Mass News reporter Kayla Burton joins us live in studio after speaking exclusively with Nesson Red Sox studio host Tom Karen on what you can expect this season. Kayla. Well, Chris and Jordan, one thing we can all expect is that there's really only one way to go, and that is strictly up after a brutal season by the Sox last year. I spoke with Tom Karen, who tells me between manager Alex Cora's return and some new players added to the team, Red Sox Nation could be in for a pleasant surprise. It's a new year and a new season for the Sox after finishing in last place in the American League East Division. But the team now looking towards brighter days with Alex Cora back at the helm. He led the Red Sox to the 2018 World Series title. He brings them confidence and he brings them almost a little swagger. And it's hard to have a little swagger after one of the worst seasons in history in 2020. And it really was. I mean, it was as bad as it gets last year for the Red Sox. But I noticed from day one, you know, he's been humbled, right? He, he paid that one year penalty and he paid his dues and he got another chance. But I think he's back with a little chip on his shoulder. The Sox, though, losing some key players at the plate. Plus, last year's pitching staff had the highest earned run average in the 100-plus year history of the Red Sox. Now, despite all the struggles, Karen acknowledging Cora's statement to Red Sox Nation before spring training, saying don't sleep on the Sox because he has full confidence they are going to be better this year than a lot of people think. We all are praying and hoping that is the truth. Now, we know the team has lost some of its go-to players, so who should we be keeping our eyes on to lead this team and what new guys could be making a statement? We'll hear and we'll get Karen's inside scoop on that tonight at 10 and 11. Plus, you can catch the Red Sox in action this weekend on Nesson as the team faces the Minnesota Twins on Saturday and then the Atlanta Braves on Sunday. Both games at 105. Live in studio, Kayla Burton, Western Mass News.